I really love the classic style. I love my new bikes as well, but uh, I suppose it all harks back to my father's era. Uh, my father raced uh, a lot of Norton's uh, 500 Maxes, um, a lot of Japanese machines as well, Hondas. Um, just about anything you can name my dad raced. So I, I, my heart is really with the old school. Uh, well, my father got started uh, in the late 50s. I think one of the first things he actually ever did was uh, the Scottish six day trials, uh, which is a really tough, tough event to do. Uh, and from there, uh, through his father, my grandfather, who was the first guy to import Italian bikes to England, specifically Ducatis and Goodsies, um, he had the opportunity to go racing. Uh, my grandfather supplied the machinery, but uh, my grandfather being the hard man that he was, it was the case of, right, if you want that, you have to earn it, and by earning it, that meant being first. Second place was a fancy word for a loser, so. <laughs> Hopefully in the future we'll be moving into new markets, hopefully even to the States and further out into Europe. Uh, if all that goes well then maybe we'll start doing some extra uh, special edition um, race bikes. But I uh, say that's for the future, there's it's, it's still a lot to be organised with that yet. So we'll see, fingers crossed. Well I started coming down the Ace Cat about 56, 57, and I've been asked a lot of times what was the Ace Cafe really like, and I can tell you and sum that up. If you look at an old Wild West film of Wild Earth cleaning up Dodge City, that's exactly how the Ace Cafe was. Great days, and, you know, and we used to make the rules up as we used to go along. When you look at this road now, it's completely different with the underpass, but we had the old bridges and the sound from the exhaust. Uh, the notes of the exhaust, it was great. And we'd come past here and all the lads would be here with the old bill behind us, the old place behind us, chasing us. How does it make you feel when you see a young fellow in his 20s that's into the rocker era? Uh, well, it makes me feel quite proud, really, you know, that they, they look at us and, and they like what they saw, and now they, they're, imi well, not imitating, but they're, they're trying to bring that period back. Um, you know, it's, it's, a, no, it's a young man's thing, really, and it's great fun. I can always remember my first uh, time on a bike and I thought I was the business, you know, going down the road, probably doing about 30, 40 miles an hour, not knowing anything, you know, but it was great fun at the time.